When it comes to the question of why was there a breaking down of the black family in the last quarter of the 20th century, there are different theories. And unfortunately, a lot of these theories either are just wrong or misses the mark. The reality, however, is that it has to do with a shifting of cultural values that took place around the 60s going into the 70s uh, at the behest of this kind of protest politics that was going on at the time, including second wave feminism. This feminist spirit that was active around that time caused a lot of young black women, especially black college students, to rebel against black men. Nikki Giovanni admitted this to James Baldwin in 1971. I think the only thing that's really changed is the black woman. Because there was a time, let's say my mother, you know what I mean, my aunts and things like that, they would say, okay, if that's the way you establish your manhood, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go for it. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. my generation says, hey, mm -hmm. no good. Okay. You must okay. establish I'll a agree. new base. I'll agree with and, that. and we are as a group demanding that a new base be established. And I don't think that that's asking too much. Because if I wanted a provision, you know, said I would get a camper. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Mm -hmm. I would get a camper that provides things. You know what I mean? You, you get an army surplus kit mm -hmm. that provides. Mm -hmm. things. The fact that many black men lost their women to the feminist culture and then they too were able to follow suit uh, to where they were also demoralized by the culture to the extent where they weren't at home taking care of their own families, taking care of their own kids, not all, but many, is reflective of what happened in the Garden of Eden where Adam was supposed to uh, protect his wife, but his wife uh, was swept away, was allured, if you will, by what Satan was trying to offer her, and then he too followed suit. I understand that this isn't a take that is accepted by the mainstream media, but it's the truth. And as long as our mainstream historians, our mainstream scholars evade the truth, we're gonna continue to go down this downward spiral. Thank you for watching the video. If you like what you saw, please be sure to like the video, share the video, subscribe to my channel to see more content like this. I hope to grow my YouTube channel a little more, maybe even interview some of the folks who have influenced uh, the way that I think. I'm going to be spending a lot more time over here on YouTube. So again, thank you and God bless.